So what's up guys, in this video, we will be making a wedding cake with gold in mind. Making a wedding cake with gold in mind. So like this, like it's start to finish. But then I'm really done in the middle here. If you've not watched this video on how I make good crackers, just be here to watch it then. Um, it just probably a, a, a um, how do I call it, an educative video on how to make good crackers, how to make good crackers with fire, with fire metal. But then, but then, uh, link in the description. If you guys cover this cake, I did. If you watched my last video, you know that this cake was a fail, total fail. So I will just be um, covering it again. But we'll be panning, panning it this time. And hopefully it turns out well. So I'll just quickly be applying the um, butter cream so the fondant can stick properly to the cake. We are trying to go back and the product can stick properly to the cake where it is left. Make sure you touch the, the, the bottom part so that it doesn't stain. So you get to your tip and measure the top. These are about 4 inches and this is 7 inches high. And so 4 inches are 7 inches high. So we will be covering this cake right now with panel method. So I've um, cut a piece of phone that my hand is not beating. What is that not beating? Clean your tools. So I'll just cut a bit. I need four inches, so I don't really need much. So putting it outside. I'm sure it doesn't fall to the ground. So I'll just need it for my four inches top. Mm. 
Okay. I just need to oh, I need this for the bit. I need it touching. Okay. So right about now, I'll get my water and I will just wait here to accommodate the top. Wait here to accommodate the top. Then with this I'll just put it. Then I will be working for my shop page. So the idea right now is to basically just join them together from 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 the on from the beneath. Okay. So you can actually flip where it's a board. In the board, you can actually flip. Yes. Using a bit of foam to clean the excess. Yeah. Then, where is my knife? You find the middle and cut. Okay. Okay. Remove this. Then you carry your water gum at the edges. Then bring your two scrapers and you join them. So, as it's like this right now, you could just you can use this to cut it. Like that. This is one, you can use this to cut it. Sliding, why is it sliding? Why is it sliding? Ah. Oh, 
nicht was ist. So this is going to be toast. This I will form that way. I'm gonna try it again. This passion of this informant. So, we should cover this with the background. Believe it or not, I'm, I'm getting a lot of experience doing this all over and over again. Believe it or not, I'm getting a lot of experience doing this all over and over again. Starting again, I need more fun now. I need to start with this. I'm going to go from there to this one. So, putting this aside, start by going with all these uh, uh, things. So, that I know what the other thing is doing. So, breaking it up.
okay? Right here, business with the top of the cake. That's what I'll do first. Top of the cake. Let's see how they get out of here. Just gonna make our video a bit. The first part a bit fast. I'm gonna make it the first part a bit fast. Move this aside because it's like infestation of somewhere. Okay. So this is the base, the top of the cake. We set it aside while we roll for the body. All these crumbs at the top. Not as good to waste, I promise you. Nothing again to waste. I promise you. So we need sixteen by seven. Make it light, nice and wrong. Remove a little distraction from the table. Remove a little distraction from the table. Let's draw them aside. So we need sixteen by eleven. This area should be close. Sixteen by seven or well, sixteen by eight. I'm going to get this method. So I'm being more careful now so that the thing will not just Okay. Make sure your uh, product doesn't seem to be gone. I think that's not the, the major problem with beginners. I'm still a beginner by the way. <gasps> yes. So that I will say this is good by 17. So I'm going to do one more stretching in this, at this angle. Stretch your nipples. How? Sides to cut. Yes. I think we are ready. So cutting now. This is seventeen. So I'm just going to cut a straight line here. What do I have here? Nine, okay. Nine by eighteen. I need fourteen actually. So since this is straight, I'll, I'll go from here and I will cut fifteen inch here. Okay. This is what all nine. This is actually. So we're cutting from nine. This is what. Seven. Okay. Okay. I think we are set. Putting this aside for more time. So now the trick is, I'll flip it to this. Let's 
squeezes. No, only one way is this. I board. The big board. About this. Okay, do this. I'll put it to this. Then I'll work on it from here. Yes. So, first things first. I'm gonna wet this. to make sure the glue round. So I think we're getting somewhere. So the, the idea is to use this thing to cut it. That's the idea. To use this thing to cut it. You see when you've if you hit hard enough and well enough, it is just going to come out on this hole. So you just go on here. Because you can spread here, so you have more room to walk. You can spread here, so you have more room to walk. Then, you can use this to cut like a semi round border. this okay so you have more room for accuracy then So yeah, you could So yes, I've got this kid. Believe me or not, I have covered this cake. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to find two of these edges with something I'll show you later on in the video or later on in the next, in the next video. I think this, this video is just to cover, cover two cakes. Preparing wedding cakes. Preparing them so to design the grace of wedding cake, I guess. So I'm just going to flip it and drop it here. Yes. So for the other video, for this other one, I'm going to do what I know best. What I know best. So, bring in this one. And, uh, so, to be on the safer side, I'll just be gluing this to this the small hole through. Yeah. Small. 
So moving on. So covering the parawa. That's my ruler. Eight inches for mm. eight by seven by I need eight by seven by what is gonna be the length? Twenty seven. Twenty six. I just must think this one time is going to be guys. Eight inches. I hope this front is gonna be enough. This baby is probably eight inches. Put my hand so dirty. So for eight inches. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. This is what I know. Just right now, I still have the time. Just wait the top a bit so that it should just keep on. So it should start soaking on time. You get? You feel me? You feel me? Good. Drop this aside. Drop this aside. Come here. Take a bit of fondant. This is the cleaning process. You just use it and clean. Use it and clean because you need to add it to this other batch. When you know once it's clean enough, toss this out. You need everything. So right now I look for length 26 by um, length 26. Length 26. Oh. So what, how high you're going to achieve that on time is you will just after kneading <coughs> some little truth tr scratch over there. Let's start this time once Yes, I started this. This is my recording device then. I'm just making it too long by rolling it like this, like so. Evenly. Roll it like so, how many times do that one? Right. <coughs> so I think this is by seven. Take a corn flour, spread it. Then you roll. Has to be enough. I have more than one that left.
Oh, 20. I need 25. So just Nine by eight. Okay, I think we're gonna, we're gonna do some final smoothing. Then I can I can need to sharpen this second blunt. So after the refine and fresh checking, I will just roll it carefully. Cutting both sides. Okay, then we here drink our water. That water.
all that out. Then let's make sure everywhere up is nice and smooth. Everywhere up is nice and smooth. Then just roughly cut Okay, then you just so right now you have to wait for this to dry a bit before you cut out the, uh, the final edges so it should just be sharper. Then when after that you just uh, need a very thin layer of fondant and just put on top to cover it. So yeah, that, this is what I'm doing. I think I'll just do my method. So basically, I think we're coming to the end of this video, and um, in the next part I will be. Um, stacking the cakes and starting our decoration process basically so yeah so um please watch the like subscribe and leave a comment if this video was educated so if you learned one or two from this video i believe you guys you guys have learned something from my experience i guess so i'm gonna catch you next time because i have to rest a bit peace